How often should you bathe a dog? Splish splash, does your dog need a bath? Most humans shower once each day, but how often do you have to wash your dog? We'll get down and dirty with the facts on the way to keep your furry friend looking fresh and clean to make sure a cheerful, healthy pup, how often to wash your dog? Bathing your dog isn't just good for his or her hygiene, it's also a superb chance to see for unusual scratches, bumps, fleas and other abnormalities, this stuff are easier to ascertain when their hair is wet and flat against their body. But how often do you have to wash your puppy? There are a couple of factors that determine your pup's bath routine. Number 1. Hair length, does your dog have long hair which will trap dirt and debris? Or are they short-haired and fewer vulnerable to getting grimy? Number 2. Activity level, a dog who is usually indoors and stays out of trouble when they're outside is perhaps cleaner than a dog who likes to dig holes, play within the park, appear waste or go swimming. Number 3. Allergies and skin conditions, some dogs have skin allergies or other health conditions that make them susceptible to needing a shower more or less frequently. At a minimum, it's advised to bathe your dog at least once every three months. You can wash your dog as frequently as every other week, with gentle shampoo, it could be even more frequent. When in doubt, use your judgment, if your dog starts to smell, it's probably time for a bath. Is it bad to bathe your dog every week? It can be. Your dog needs natural oils produced by the skin to promote hair growth. Plus over bathing can cause irritation and dryness. So don't overdo it. CBD oil can help calm a dog before bath time. Many dogs become anxious when it's time to hop within the tub, to assist ease your dog's anxiety, you'll give your dog a touch CBD oil or a CBD infused treat. Give your vet a call before administering any CBD products, and if approved for your dog, bath time could become a soothing, bonding experience for you both. How to bathe a dog, 8 bathing tips. How does one bathe a dog correctly? It are often tricky trying to tame your pup within the tub while also washing them, because of the following pointers, giving a dog a shower is simpler than you think that. Try these simple steps to make sure you've got a successful bath time together with your furry friend. Number 1. Buy shampoo and other supplies. Pro Pet Works Natural Oatmeal Dog Shampoo Pro Pet Works Natural Oatmeal Dog Shampoo Use a dog-specific shampoo or a baby shampoo to stop suds stinging their eyes. We recommend you employ a hypoallergenic and every one natural shampoo to scale back potential skin irritations and dryness. Have a rubber or non-stick bath linen handy for the bathtub keeps them from slipping and sliding an excessive amount of both inside and out of doors the tub. Also, have cotton balls able to gently place in their ears to damn water out. Number 2. Don't forget to brush. This step can easily get overlooked. Before bath time, prep your pup by giving them a radical brushing to urge obviate tangles and excess hair. Number 3. Pick a spot and stick with it. Rinse Ace Three Way Pet Shower Sprayer. Rinse Ace Three Way Pet Shower Sprayer. Wondering the way to bathe a scared dog? Consistency is critical when it involves keeping your pet clean and calm. Bathing are often uncomfortable, so having an area they're conversant in will ease their fears or a minimum of allow them to know what to expect. A lick pad may be a good way to urge your pup to take a seat still during a shower. Just stick the pad to the side of the bathtub or countertop if your dog bathes within the sink and add spread. This combo is certain to stay your pup distracted and entertained, so you'll specialize in cleaning. If you reside during a smaller apartment, a tub with a handheld shower sprayer is sufficient. If they're smaller or a puppy, you'll also use the sink. There are special tubs only for bathing dogs, but if you're already tight on space, this won't be an honest option. Have an outside area and live where the temperature to wash dogs outside is warm year-round? Then outside could be a far better option, but confirm it's on a flat, sturdy surface like concrete or a deck, so you're not counterproductive washing them within the muddy grass or yard. A kitty pool can double as an outside doggy spa too. Number 4. Gather before you lather once your pup is wet, you'll have your hands full so having everything you would like nearby is important, put aside a clean towel, cup for rinsing, if need be, and treats for afterward or during permanently behavior. Never leave a dog unattended within the tub, and if you're outside, confirm your dog is contained or on a leash. Number 5. Some love it hot, water temp matters, can I bathe my dog in cold water, may be a common question we hear. Lukewarm to slightly warm water is right. Never use scalding predicament because it can burn your dog's skin, consider what would be good for a neonate or a little child. Not too hot, not too cold. Number 6. Clean from bottom to top, rinse from head to tail follow the instructions on the shampoo bottle, then lightly lather the soap during a circular motion paying particular attention to their paws and other places susceptible to dirt. Start with their feet and work your high to their face last. This will stop soap from dripping into their eyes and ears also as hamper on shaking. Rinse ranging from the top and work your way down until the stream is obvious. This helps the shampoo wash down and far away from their sensitive spots. Number 7. 
Towel or blow. Dry covering your pup during a towel retains heat and also lessens the probabilities of them shaking water everywhere you and your house. If it's cold, or your dog has long hair that takes longer to dry, you would possibly think about using a dog hand blower to hurry up the method. Number 8. Make it fun. Are you trying to work out the way to provide a dog a shower that hates baths? Make it enjoyable. Bathing are often a bonding experience for both you and your dog. Take baby, or puppy, steps introducing them to water and dealing up to a full bath. Don't take the plunge directly, twiddling my thumbs and be gentle. If your dog senses you're stressed they're going to be too. Confirm you reward with treats and show many love and affection. Can I provide a dog a shower without water? Wondering the way to provide a dog a shower reception without water? It's possible using quick bath dog wipes to settle down the stink. They reduce bacteria and odors. Wipes are always good to possess available, especially within the car for those dirtier post-dog park moments. You'll also use a dog brush to urge the grime out. Lastly, if your dog starts to smell up the house, you would possibly want to undertake a pet odor neutralizer. Check out this 90 second video to see an expert from Petco Bay the lab using some of the tricks and techniques we shared above. Source, Canine Journal. You can find the link to his video in the description of this video. Bathing is essential to your dog's health and we recommend giving a bath every four to six weeks depending on breed. It keeps his coat beautiful and his skin healthy. Before his bath, give your dog a good brush out and detangle any gnats. Then gather your supplies so they're all within reach. Towels, shampoo and conditioner, ear cleaner, cotton balls, a non-slip mat, and of course, don't forget the treats. Cover the bathing area with a non-slip mat or towel. Then clean your dog's ears if they're dirty or have an odor, and put clean cotton balls in them to keep the water out. Be careful though not to put them in too deep. Now we're ready. Use lukewarm water. A sprayer will help get your dog's coat thoroughly wet all the way to the skin. Use a dog shampoo and conditioner that's best for your dog's coat and follow the directions on the label. Work up a good lather. Starting from the back, save his head for last to avoid getting any shampoo in his eyes or ears. Now it's time to rinse. Start with the head and rinse from the top down until the water runs clear and then give a good towel dry. You can also use a hair dryer on a cool setting if your dog doesn't mind. Bathing keeps your dog healthy and happy, and it's great quality time together. When he's all done, be sure to reward him with a treat and lots of praise. Would you like to subscribe to our channel? We would appreciate it from the heart.